hope it is a second message to the United Nations and the UNESCO. Everything which is told by Martha Lixon and the cat Lixon is unfortunate for their goodbye. <coughs> I don't have any problems with my hands or with my arms. Um, I'm a trained uh, piano player and I don't have any tender when you need to or um, school, the as in trying to do whatever. Um, so if they're telling that I'm not able to work, or I'm not able to work on a computer, or I'm not able to play piano concerts, uh, this is a huge lie and bullshit. Uh, on the contrary, my hands are in perfect form, everything is wonderful. Uh, I'm able to play concerts, I'm able to work on the computer. Uh, I don't have any troubles at all with my uh, health particular uh, if you're uh, if you're talking about my hands or arms, uh, everything is in perfect form. I'm absolutely sure that my father Vixen was uh, raping me a lot of times. Same goes for Marcos Caddy, he was raping me a lot of times. And then my father was raping me a lot of times. <coughs> I'm sorry, I'm just having food. And, um, I'm absolutely sure that, um, uh, they would like me to do, to to be dead body because so um yeah because they're using my entire production for Leonie Vixenhawk they are probably thinking she's my biological door I'm not sure about that because I know they've been um putting me on a lot of treatment treatments meaning that I was uh, given birth uh, without any comprehension of it, so I've been putting some sperms into my vagina and uh, withdrawing the very, very small embryos uh, and babies are out of me and uh, putting them into the uh, under the lamp uh, to be growing. So, as a medical research product, so uh, I might be the biological father, even uh, mother, even of Billie Eilish, or um, uh, I don't know, Justin Bieber, or Lady Vicks, uh, because I know, I feel that uh, I have a lot of children which are uh, living somewhere in some families, but I don't know anything about them, or I'm not getting in touch with them. Um, it was a part of a medical research uh, made by Brigitte Bayer, Marcus Kalle, and my father. So I'd like to, t <coughs> to say to everyone that uh, even if they uh, hurt my body and they put me into some surgery, I'm absolutely in the perfect form to play concert and to be a musician on stage and to be a performer. They just are um, trying to uh, do everything to steal my uh, creative projects from me, from me uh, because they're all kind of salaries and I'm the one more it. Uh, but on a country I feel like much more like Mark Chagall or uh, Charlie Chaplin who got very, very, very old, so I'm not this kind of uh, early dying genius. So this is why they are so keen to kill me, and this is why Quentin Tarantino uh, is kind of killing me as a as an author in the first scene of his movie, which is kind of about me, or which is uh, made according to my screenplay. So this is badly done, Quentin Tarantino. I'm a prophet, I know everything which is happening behind my back. So I don't you dare to kill me in the first day. It's very stupid of you because I'm not sure when you you're gonna be dying, dying earlier than I.